Welcome back to a can of peas. We're uh heading on back to Sindri's house. That's what we're doing. We're gonna continue on with the story. That's what I want to do. Now tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah, the inevitable asking of the dwarves. <laughs> I mean, it obviously means he respects their insight. So that's good. Mm. Excuse me, sir, could I have a moment of your time? Of course, oh, dear, oh, dear. What's to be done? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain, and as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Uh... Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. Oh. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned worms will be a walk in the park. All that said, I'm happy to discuss anything else on your mind. It's a box. Well then, what else, friends? Oh, that's it. It's a box. I have a box. For leaned worms. Leaned worm box. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. Hey, where's uh, where's big guy? I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need him. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. <laughs> I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch Dropnir. Can... Can you, uh, elaborate? Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will this help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artists. But to even store Dropnir, you need... You were saying... Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you plot, I understand that my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. I'm worried about you, Sindri. You don't look like you're doing too hot. 
You really don't look like you're doing too hot, Sindri. Old buddy, old pal. That's a lot of rings. left hand and he carries the horn that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we and should... And it's just as likely a trap because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention we'll have to visit... the lady. Oh. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Kratos, whenever you're ready. <clears throat> right. I wonder what we're exactly doing. The lady. No idea what he's on about, brother. See you out there. Uh huh. Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh, no. This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. I you heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. <laughs> what the? <sighs> no, you shrimps think that'll keep us out we'll think the fuck again hmm back to Svartalheim what was all that then oh just Sindri trying to hog all the glory same old shit not that the gate what's wrong with a bloody gate most likely someone in need of a lip been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursioning you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates said never even think to look for. On account of being stupid. Fair enough. Let's get moving, Brock. Where are we? Oh, where'd you come Here's from? your stop. Abandoned service time. Direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? No. I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Why? Why are you down here? Like, why? Unusual surface here. Elvish, I think. You hit something earlier. Oh, well. Where we go? Ooh. Hit that. Thank you. That was a big one. Excuse me. 
Don't you hate it whenever a sneeze just like really comes out of nowhere? and explosives. Look on the nose for dwarven culture. <laughs> Ridiculing the culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, all right. Might have earned that one. Yeah. Yeah, I think she has a point on that one. But still, it is kind of funny. Good bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. I have said it better myself, Kratos. I get the feeling we're gonna have to fight something bad. That tends to be how these things go. It's an abandoned service tunnel. That looks flammable. That looks flammable? That doesn't look flammable. Oh. 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 Yeah. That felt good. I'm gonna be needing the blades a lot today. Cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating? <laughs> not a thing. I feel like you're insinuating quite a lot. There's a lot of implications with what you're saying. Kratos doesn't want to kill another pantheon. Now his son might. Well, his son might not want to kill him, but his son's probably going to end up doing it. You know, like father, like son. Another oil spill. Hell yeah. Boom, shakalaka. A fortuitous oil spill. Everything's fortuitous when you have imagination. Fucking cookout, huh? Fuck off! Fuck off! Come here! 
How that feel? Woo. Kratos. Kratos. What? What? Hey. So what's up? Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But. Oh dear. Nah. <sighs> What what are you on about, man? Boom. Get some angry juice. Money. Well, that's a lot of money. Nice. What we got over here? It's not his Pumpkins. fault Atreus ran off you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again. You're insinuating, and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. Where there's a gear like that, there's usually a chain somewhere. Uh huh. The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. Uh, okay. Let's see. I see. I see what's going on here. First, you're gonna do that. You're gonna do that. And then I'm going to do this. Yeah, buddy. I love blowing shit up. I really love blowing shit up. Oh! So cool. Barrel go boom. Ooh. Chest. Stuff. Things. Another heavy ring attack. What we got here? Mm -hmm. we'll, uh, we'll think on it. We will think upon it. I would love a heavy attack for my blades. That'd make me happy. These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that cross Oh. Okay, I see what's going on here. Bam! That was a pretty simple puzzle. It's gonna get complicated, I know. Make it real complicated, like the damn link things. Oh, hello! Fuck off! Come here! How's this feel? How about that? These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. No, they won't. We'll That's need okay. to get one of those gates open. Ugh. That worked. Shall we? This opinion of yours. 
Was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok? That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. What is that? I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting my... I know. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take. Uh, she's got a point, Kratos. I hate to tell you. She's talking. She's talking good. Oh, okay, I got it. Okay, um. See what's going on here. Oh. Sigil arrows won't work on this. Got it. I'm so smart. Now, where have they got the third one hidden away? Love hiding shit. I have a feeling, though. I got a feeling. Woohoo! Oh, it looks like a tear. Okay, well, the gate stayed open. That's nice of it. I think I come back to that later. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. You know, I know you killed her son and all. Freya's a pretty nice lady, Kratos. Who else are you going to find someone that hates God as much as you do? Nowhere, that's where. Oh. Careful! Those grim are protected by nightmares. They'll be even more dangerous until we stun them. Come here! I wonder when they're going to bring that back.
Come here. Come here. Take that. Oh yeah. The big slammer. Atreus's mother was a giant, isn't that right? She was one of the Jotnar. Yes. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with the disparity in size. Or number of limbs, say. Nothing in the world. <laughs> Oh! I love it when things explode. I forget where I came from to get in here. You can go up here. Ooh, money. I love money. Love treasure. Gimme. Just wanting that third Norn torch. That's all I want in life. Don't hide it from me. I want it. can open the other gate. It's great and all, but I want Why the North Torch. I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. Nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything you haven't thought. Her secrets haunt every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talk to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your fate. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant, sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. You're right. It's not for me to say. Where is right. this goddamn Let's torch? Let's get that wheel turning. If I had to guess, this one's probably... <gasps> no use without water in the trough. <gasps> Just out of place. Stop. There it goes. Ah, teamwork. teamwork make the dream work. Hey, that's one of those need hog things. Oh. Whoa, hello. And oh. oh. Here. 
Really? That was some bullshit. That was also on me, because I kept wanting to do the charge attack, but whatever. That was some bullshit. Permission to die. Well, who's ready for some fresh air after that? Everyone thought so. I close. I love can feel fresh it. air. I love fresh air so much. Fuck these tunnels. Fuck them right to hell. I'd really like to find that fucking Norn torch, though. I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. And I know something about that. Well, that's time for this episode, everyone. That was some that was a nice insightful note to end on. Oh. Well, like, comment, subscribe if you like what you see here. Come back and see more. Ring that bell and uh see you again next time on the canopies. Bye-bye.